cardiac and circulatory system. The cardiovascular system consists of the heart, blood vessels and the approximately 5 liters of blood that the blood vessels transport, responsible for transporting oxygen, nutrients, hormones and cellular waste products throughout the body. The cardiovascular system is powered by the body's hardest working organ, the heart. The heart. The heart is a muscular pumping organ located medial to the lungs along the body's midline in the thoracic region. The top of the heart, known as the heart base, connects to the great blood vessels of the body, the aorta, vena cava, pulmonary trunk and pulmonary veins. The circulatory pump. The heart is a four-chambered double pump where each side, left and right, operates as a separate pump. The right side of the heart receives deoxygenated blood from the systematic veins and pump it to the lungs for oxygenation. The left side of the heart receives oxygenated blood from the lungs and pump it through the systematic arteries to the tissues of the body. Circulatory loops. There are two primary circulatory loops in the human body. Pulmonary circulation. Transports deoxygenated blood from the right side of the heart to the lungs where the blood picks up oxygen and returns to the left side of the heart. Systematic circulation. Carries highly oxygenated blood from the left side of the heart to all of the tissues of the body with the exception of the heart and lungs. Blood vessels. Blood vessels are the body's highways that allow blood to flow quickly and efficiently from the heart to every region of the body and back again. There are three major types of blood vessels, arteries, capillaries and veins. Arteries and arteoles. Arteries are blood vessels that carry blood away from the heart. Blood carried by arteries is usually highly oxygenated. Arteries face high levels of blood pressure. To withstand this pressure, the walls of the arteries are thicker, more elastic and more muscular than those of other vessels. Capillaries Capillaries are the smallest and thinnest of the blood vessels in the body. Capillaries connect to arteoles and venules. Capillaries carry blood very close to the cells of the tissues of the body in order to exchange gases, nutrients and waste products. Veins and venules Veins are the large return vessels of the body. The walls of veins are much thinner less elastic and less muscular than the walls of arteries. Veins rely on gravity, inertia and the force of skeletal muscle contraction to help push blood back to the heart. Blood The average human body connects about 4 to 5 liters of blood. Blood is made up of red blood cells, white blood cells, platelets and liquid plasma. The cardiovascular system has three major functions. Transportation of materials, production of pathogens and regulation of the body's homeostasis. 